I am building an orbital command in my base, so at least I am looking to expand. I probably have accepted the fact that I can't grab this location, so I may lift it off here to the southern location, using the Terran versatility to my advantage. Trying to protect this missile turret, it looks like. I don't want to stray too close to this bunker. Um, looks like I am just choosing to let that missile turret go down. I should be replacing it. The uh, racist is dropping three star ports. Once again, three star ports from one SCV is not the best use of your time. But he is switching to air nonetheless. And actually, it seems that I'm not going to be able to. I mean, if I don't get these, if I don't replace that missile turret and maybe throw up some more, like three or four more, my base will be very much exposed to air units. So that is a threat from racist, certainly. My orbital command is in play, although foolishly I'm not saturating it. That is going to be detrimental to my success. I've got a bunch of energy here on my second orbital command. I actually I have control grouped it into my orbital command group, but oh, I'm sorry, I apologize. I missed an encounter. One siege siege tank goes down to my infantry units, but with the combined fire of these two marauders and that bunker, my main attack force is pushed away. Unfortunately, I was not able to capture all of that battle, but. Uh, the results are clear nonetheless. This siege tank string much too far to my bunker. That's a free kill for my bunkermen's. Combat shields are completed for racists, whereas myself I have not reached I have not researched stim or or combat shields. Uh, I do however have one one upgrades on my guys though. Operating off of three barracks, I finally have saturated this position with mules, although for some reason my control point for my SUVs is rallied here. That is a huge error. Finally dropping some missile turrets, at least one over here. I don't know if that's the best location, but... Racist seems to be content with his little contain. He's sitting at 1,000 minerals, which is probably 1,000 minerals too many, but he actually is creating a raven, so he chose to go for two starports with tech labs, pumping a single raven right now. Trying to defend the natural expansion of his own with these siege tanks, bunkers, and general infantry. Scan going down on my base, he's going to see this one supply depot actually sieging up. So that supply depot is done for. He is actually also in range of this refinery, but we have a very large clash here. My siege tank taking the brunt of the damage here. These two tanks are actually going to be sieging up. They should be able to take down these marauders pretty easily. my units forced to pull back and away from the range of the siege tanks. So this contain is once again very successful for racist. Um, I have my uh, second or first expansion running before racist is though, so switching to income that is reflected on the scoreboard. I have about 700 minerals incoming per minute, whereas racist is sitting at about 550. Just now coming up on 15 minutes, the Terranverse tension is rising, as it often does. Lifting off that barracks for whatever reason, probably just to just making some more room here for my front door. With the help of these two medevacs, I'm feeling relatively confident. I am now starting to operate and fully saturate the second position. These siege tanks causing problems for my, for my mineral line though. Let's see what these marauders and medevacs and marines can do, taking out these this small infantry force. An auto turret coming down from racist, so decent use of the raven, once again forcing me to pull back, so... R racist has completely halted my Vespine income from this refinery, and he's also continuing to fortify his contain. Finally losing that supply depot, dropping an auto turret in my mineral line. Very irritating. Uh, as I said earlier, I wasn't able to get enough missile turrets up in time, and now there's a lot of siege tank pressure on my main base. He doesn't have any vision over here, he should throw down a scan to continue the pressure of those siege tanks. Finally taking down that missile turret in my base. I should get an SCP here to complete this incomplete supply depot. Uh, my saving grace right now is the fact that I have a... Uh, a fully saturated or almost fully saturated about halfway there now natural expansion kind of a hidden expansion actually in the southernmost location on this scorched haven map I 
I think what I'm not doing well in this game is making good use of dropships. I should be using this dropship, which is right now going to fall, or almost dying, to the pressure of those marines. But goodness, uh, hopefully for my sake anyway, this bunker burns down. This siege tank trying to siege up, that is going to get destroyed before I'm able to do any damage with it. I have one siege tank remaining, however. That should be enough to deter this infantry push. One marauder remaining in my base. This raven will fall to the uh, combined turret fire of my raven. Racist expressing his displeasure with that little uh, realization. But this auto turret is causing a lot of problems for me in my base. These siege tanks, and now we have two banshees actually up in my junk, focusing my orbital command. Those marines are no match for the banshees. This banshee remains with 21 HP. It looks like I just don't have the APM required to get rid of these banshees, um, take down these siege tanks, and uh, eliminate the raven threat in my back door. Or my mineral line, I should say. Trying to throw up some, some missile turrets in retaliation. This siege tank is going to catch these siege tanks out of position. Uh, this siege tank finally outranging my own siege tank. And Racist's machine is going to be shelling all of my or all of my SCVs here at my native position. And even though Racist does have problems with spending his minerals and playing a macro based game, he certainly knows where to hit a player. Uh, he knows how to kick a player when he's down. That Marauder just falling complete prey to these backlash rockets. He can't even run away in time. I don't have any missile turrets here to push back these banshees. I don't know why they're retreating actually. He, he could be pushing up the pressure. This contain is still very much intact for racists and it looks like I am in a lot of trouble. <laughs> My uh, uh, original orbital command here has completely fallen and it looks like I'm trying to set up a uh, emergency base here in the southern location. There's only one minute remaining in this game. I can't remember how it ends. I think I I might GG out of it just in disgust, although that would be unwise right now. I have this dropship full of infantry units, uh, and I'm still operating off of one base, so... That is scanned now from Racist. He's going to be heading over there, and I have no missile turrets up, so definitely there are areas where I could have done much better in this game. I could have had more missile turrets in play, I could have reacted better to this contain that racist set up outside my junk. Certainly I just did not make key decisions where I needed to. So I do expect a good game from Wrapped in a second now. Um, for all of racist's shortcomings notwithstanding, he has found himself on the winning end of this Terran vs. Terran exchange. There goes the last bastion of hope for the red Terran player. These Banshees uh, confirming victory for Racist. I do have stim packs now, but it's not going to be enough. Even with the healing of this medevac, Racist just has his main base, main base fortified too well. And now I am being revealed, so not much hope remains for me. I call good game.